Hey everybody, this is Don over Johnny Z's Cars. Today I'm sure this 2009 Nissan Skyline 250 GT that just came in. It's got almost 78,000 kilometers on it, which is right at 48,000 miles. Before we get started, I'd like to let you know that we do have on a lot discounts. So the price you're seeing on the website right now will not be the final price when you come on a lot. Also, if you're arriving to Okinawa soon or you just arrived, please make sure you stop by Johnny Z's Cars as soon as you can and have a look around. Even before you get yourself a driver's license, there are benefits to doing it that way. So with that, let's go ahead and take a look around and uh, show you the features inside. Um, but first, I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos. going to answer a lot of your questions. Uh, so things like the uh, JCI, the warranty, the financing, I cover all that and more. So please bear with me until the end. You have all the answers. If not, please contact me or stop on by. This Nissan Skyline is a five-passenger vehicle in the 300 series category, so the larger category. Road tax per year is going to be 19,000 yen, which is about $140 right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April, May time frame. So we'll take it every for you the remainder of the, uh, this year of the 2022, and you won't have to worry about it until uh, uh, April, May. Now you do have two options to pay for it. First one being US dollars cash out rate, which could get you a larger discount, or you can take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Yes, we don't have a down payment requirement, but if you want to put something down, reduce your overall monthly payments, you can. A lot of our customers do like 500 to 1,000. Some do half, some do more. Up to you. Before we go inside, it was like showing the rain guards. Rain guards will allow you to roll your windows down a little bit this way. If it rains, it's not going to get wet inside. More important feature benefit is it's going to give you that cross ventilation. Get that extremely hot air out. And always get yourself a good windshield visor. So let's uh, jump on in, get this baby started. All right. I don't know who was sitting here the last time. Yeah. Uh, adjust that. Okay. So with the key fob on your person, it is a push start. Uh, foot on the brake, if just push this one time, and it goes. And uh, the good thing about this one, it does have a little key slot here that you just push that in there and it, it stays. So I'll turn this radio off, sorry Troy. Sneak this in here. Yeah. 77,008, what is that, 854 on the uh, odometer. Uh, showed a couple of warning lights, that one right there, obviously your uh, seatbelt one, make sure you wear your seatbelts, they do give tickets on and off base. And then, where is it? There it is, sorry. That one right there, the circular one, is your emergency brake. It's not a low pressure tire gauge. Uh, this one is a kick type, so when you kick it, disengage, it goes away, kick it again, it comes right back on. Other than that, it's a very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. Anything pops up on the dash while you're driving, please pull over, find out what it is, take the necessary action. Off to the left here, you do have your radio. This one, does not have a rear camera. And then you have your uh, radio controls, air conditioning controls, ashtray lighter, shifter. Let me back this up a little bit. Your, um, uh, what you call it, the um, cup holders that I can't get out, or that I can't say. And then a little uh, console armrest, uh, give you a tray up there, and then an extra power outlet. An old school uh, video input output. And then continuing off to the left, you do have your glove box over here. A little bit of storage and a uh, cup holder on each side. That is your passenger space over there. You get your red rope flare hanging out. And this guy hanging right over here is your ETC reader, the electronic toll collector. This works like easy pass in the States if you're able to get the card for it for the expressway here, okay? And then this is the space I have on my side. I am 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. Um, yeah, I'm pretty extended, so I would definitely slide this up a few inches, be a little more comfortable driving, okay? Uh, let's go. I, actually, I'm going to keep it in the back position. Uh, it does have a sunglass compartment as well. Let's go eye level. That's my eye level right there. I can see a sliver of the hood, unlike many cars. All right, go all the way back. Now, normally there's a time I show you the auction sheet showing you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. Please keep that in mind, non-accident vehicle from mainland. Uh, all these other dealers out here can't tell you that. We can on every single car. Uh, but because it just came in, I keep those inside the office. Once it's been detailed, they're gonna put it up here on the sun visor so you um, have a look at it and we'll actually give that to you. All right, so before we go to the back seat, let's show you a couple other uh, items. All right. So you do have your uh, uh, trunk release right here, so don't forget that. I already showed the, the little slot for your uh, key, and then underneath that, you do have your hood release, all right? And then you have your mirror, door lock, window controls all on the door panel here. So uh, to turn it off, your foot doesn't have to be on the brake. You just go ahead and push this one time, and it goes. All right. I'm sorry, it's kind of cramped in here, but make the best of it. So I jump on the side back here. All right. All right. So with uh, the driver's seat always all the way back, all the way down, I'm a good inch and a half away from the back seat to my knees. Nothing as far as storage on the back of the driver's seat, but you do have pocket storage on the back of the passenger seat. As always, be careful what you put in there. You don't want to rip it. And then you have an ashtray here, and nothing as far as storage on the door uh, panels, but you do have this very long uh, armrest slash uh, armrest 
which on the uh, front of it, it does have, give you two cup holders. Okay, let's put that up. Go to the back. Okay. All right. There you have it, a very nice size trunk. Let's go to the engine compartment. Then I'm gonna wrap this video up. Wow, this is pretty clean. We haven't even touched it. Uh, this is a 2.5 liter V6, and it will get touched up during the detailing process, but it's actually really, really clean. And there you go, uh, 2009, what'd I say? Uh, 2009 uh, Nissan Skyline 250 GT, almost 78,000 kilometers on it, which is right at 48,000 miles. Military price goes down to 5,800 with additional military discount, we'll get it down to 5,600. Again, while you're here, please ask the information guy about on a lot discounts and you will get a lower price on this. But for now, the 5,600 will include a two year JCI, the one year bumper to bumper full warranty, the 2022 road tax, and the 10% sales tax is already included. Only thing on top will be the American insurance requirement, whether you're going liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and we can assist you with that here. Uh, touching on these warranties real quick. Yes, there are two-year warranties out here. However, they're not the best thing since sliced bread. Don't be fooled by them. Stop by, we'll explain why. All right, but uh, we do encourage you to shop around all the dealers, see what they have, but definitely stop by John G's Cars. Let us show what we have, what our program's all about, and how we're going to assist you. We are definitely making a difference out here because we are different. Stop by, we'll show you why, like we have many, many others. So don't forget, two ways to pay for it, U.S. dollars cash out rate. We're taking advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Either way, we're good to go. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.